We have a special treat. Sweet reviews are made of these. Okay. Okay. Where's he going? So we actually finally got to see something super early. Yeah, we did. Um, Big time early. This movie is not out right now. Yeah, for a change. You yes, know, we're, sir. We're monetizing. We're we're getting to go. Well, see we got we got to be humble though because new viewers might be clicking I mean, in. Hey so guys, yeah, we do this all the time. Uh, <laughs> action! So another one of our month early reviews. CTS. We're known for the month earlies. CTS. Yeah. Month early reviews. Month earlies. Trademark. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, <laughs> welcome back. I think it's our fifteenth uh, early review. Early sp- uh, press well, no, screening. Normally, <laughs> like in the summer, we were getting like a couple times. We're like a week early. Got to go see a couple things like a yeah. week early. Yeah, but we never get to do things like a literal month before. It comes no, out, not nice. like yeah. The we, the good. week early is nice. You know what I mean. Yeah. but a lot of people can you just can do jump that. on those tickets yeah. and then yeah. This is not. This is special. We're a fun movie review people. So. <coughs> Officially monetized the uh, movie channel. Uh, so milking Trolls that shit till three, it's dead. Yeah, aka Trolls band together because we had to have another music pun. Yeah, but sub, it's like subtitle pending, though. You know what I mean? It's like when the actual movie comes out, it, it'll probably just be Trolls 3. You I know think what I mean? that's for, that's like dual dual country marketing. Yeah. Like Shrek, Shrek 4 was the same way. Like it was Shrek just Shrek 4. Forth, Shrek 4. Forever After. Shrek Forever After. Sure. They had like six titles, but, you know. Yeah. Um, Trolls 3, better than 2. It probably on par with good. one. Almost as good as what? One one's has One's original, though. Things, though. Yes. One's like it's original. The first time you're in that world. You get the first time with those characters. Get back up again is one of my favorite musical things from any animated movie of all time, where what? she's singing like on her adventure. And she's oh, like, get back up. And, and she's, she's just, just getting, getting murdered, murdered by the bugs she's and happy. stuff. Yeah, yeah. That, yeah. But this was so cool. The second one felt just like a cheap cash grab, and this one actually felt like a sequel that they were like, for the most part, two felt like remnants of a series they might have been playing. Okay, you know what I mean? Like two D trolls. They had like the series or whatever. Netflix, maybe yeah. maybe that was supposed to go there but they fleshed it out into a full movie this one feels like it should have been trolls 2 should have been trolls 2 this, this one's really trolls 2 it picks up right after the first and one they mentioned like, there's lines much. in this movie uh B- tiny diamond yeah uh, keenan thompson who i love yeah <laughs> he says i'm already a month old now dad i'm not a yeah, baby yeah that's what anymore. he says he's like only a couple a month or a couple months old yeah he's born in the beginning of the second one mm-hmm and the opening music number of the second one, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. He, like, farts him out. Yeah. And he's, like, a diamond <laughs> thing. Yeah. So so we're led to believe, and then the second one picks up right after the first one. So we're led to believe pretty much everything has taken place in the last six weeks. A couple so months? Two months? Two months. Be- be- best case scenario <laughs> for time. And you also have the holiday specials that are canon. And the reason I'm talking about this is because they're like, hey, this is canon. This is a se- this is how this all works. Yeah, it's a series of events. So, <laughs> so you have the first one, and at the and then the holiday special, and then the second one, which the Bergens come back. They they come. They're like, oh, what did we miss at the very end of the second one? Okay, you get like the okay. what did we miss? <laughs> Because we're like, where are the Bergens for the entire second movie? Because you set up the whole, and you're Because not you set up do... all the Bergens, and then you're not going to do any of that? So that means that world tour thing literally had to have been like a week of an adventure. Like that whole thing has to take place with the, with the one dude. Goes Animation time is wonky. Cartoon really time's really weird. wonky, man. Everything happens in the span of like, what the entire One Piece canon is has only been like three years, maybe. See, that's... I'm like, No! But it's been it's 23 not an, it's not here, though, yeah, that's so that doesn't jive. Yeah, the first Trolls was what? In Marvel, they reference, like, you remember that thing that happened back uh, five years ago? And it's like a comic book from the 80s. But they just rounded back to, like, oh, now that's five years yeah. ago. Like, oh. At least with the movies. Like, the movies are... <laughs> they're trying. Semi... Like, they're spinning the wheels on purpose so that we don't go like, too I'm far. I'm one month old, time. Dad. And then, like, one of them... Dr- I saw you stop the world from the rock apocalypse, you know, and... So it's like they're the referencing other. everything else. Like, oh, we got to go to the, at the beginning. We got to go to the wedding. You know, the wedding. They the Bergens are getting married. Movie. Yeah, Bridget. And the second and one, they're like, "Where'd you guys go? We got to get married." King Gristle, McLovin, and Zoe Deschanel. There's so many McLovin and New Girl which, together again. She didn't sound like herself until the second half. Of the I movie. had to check. I double checked as well. I had to check. Double. Checked I was like, well. they couldn't have recast like, Zoe Deschanel. Yeah, I totally did because like. I didn't hear it, and it's so it's, it's an easy voice to do because she is putting a voice on. She is, you know, over the top in the beginning. Yeah, with so like the hard like, lisp. What's yeah. going on? This yeah, is, but yeah. It was her, and she. There's so many adult jokes in this that I feel like they understand that the parents were like new parents when the first one came out seven eight years ago, and now they're probably getting a little older. You know, what I mean? it was not a movie I went and saw. Like, 
they, they went with mom because I didn't want to go see that. Yeah. Right? And it ended up being something that I caught later going, oh, man, this is, this is really good. Yeah, like and I wrote, it off. I wrote off the first one forever. And you're like, dude. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> and, like, the second I clicked onto it, like, the animation. I love the I animation. Like, these movies. Okay. These are the ones that show DreamWorks okay. can hang with Pixar. All right. This is one of those movies. Like, all the fluff, everything looks like I want to touch it. Cottony. I want to touch like it. And they go to, like, the Dr. Seuss 70s-style cartoon in this movie yes. a couple different They showed times. a little bit in the trailer. But Lord yeah. Hustle, and he's like, hey, baby. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, it's, <laughs> yeah. it's an acid trip of a movie, for sure. This movie starts with the wedding, um, mm-hmm. and we get the, whoa, what a sweet bachelor party that was last night. And he's like... Picking peppermints and like candy he gets off, off of them. Cloud guy. Cloud guy. <laughs> and he's like, I don't feel so good. And he's like puking rainbows. It's so funny. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, man, you got me. Already. You got me. Two minutes yeah. in. I'm like, damn, this is going to be better than the second one. <laughs> what? I didn't even need the beginning stuff, though, where it's like the bro zones trying to perform, you know? Right. And like, th- we got all that in the trailer. Yeah. I'm like, I You're get right, it. I know why I'm trailer. watching the movie where they set up all the brother stuff. You know what I mean? There we're was going. A lot. My main problem, though, and that I think they did this in the beginning, is because they're like, they were. We're letting you know that we're going to retcon this to death with no lube. This movie, this universe, we're going to retcon it. There's going to be some things that... There weren't brothers in the first that one. That doesn't make any sense. There weren't brothers in the first one, right? No, but it explains his... The brothers were gone when Grandma Grams died. It explains so. Grandma and his ob- obsession with singing and why he gives it up doubly because he okay. got screwed. There's a couple things that okay. I'm like, okay, 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 okay. But then there's some other things that this did no. not work. No. Um, if this was done in two and three was world tour, then it's like, okay. Slightly better. Okay. But I don't think two, I don't, this is weird how we're saying this, but I don't think world tour is strong enough to have been like the trilogy closer, which seems like too. this one is, you know? Which, like, by the way, in case we didn't say it, there'll be spoilers. We are going to get into all the stuff we said so far oh, yeah. has been no, brought much, up in the trailer. Yeah, yeah. Like they're getting married. Bro zone, they're getting the, yeah, One they're of them's married. trapped. They got to get the brothers to get whatever. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it's we're here. We're here. Yeah. yeah. Do we want to give ratings before we... Um, in case you don't want to hear spoilers. Jump into Man. spoilies. Um, this this was way better than Ruby Gilman. Way like, better than Ruby night, Gilman. This makes me go, why didn't they have this Ruby Gilman after? crawled so Trolls 3 could fly. <laughs> yeah, this is like this wasn't obviously as good as Puss in Boots too because nope. that movie is like cinematic top tier Hall of Fame top tier animated movie. But yeah. this is as far as fun goes, it's up there. It's like, up there. I had a blast I watching liked it this more movie. Than Elemental. Yeah, I yes. Liked it. It's God, dude. I tried watching Elemental and I got twenty good. minutes in and it's, it's so like slow. All right, they start introducing shit that doesn't matter and they just like start bringing up stuff just to bring it up even, in ten seconds. Even eh, my whatever. kids weren't nah. that. I like these movies where it's like, yeah, give me the stupid fun B plot with the, the Bergens fun. on the honeymoon, and give me the stupid brothers and all their drama. Make and the Bergen fun animation. Make the queen now. Make her just yeah, relentlessly horny. Yeah, to the <laughs> point where where <laughs> Gristle is just like, Jesus. Yeah, slow down, babe. Yeah. <laughs> I I so this is either high sevens for me. Or, yeah, yeah. This um, is like Penguins of Madagascar level humor, and I loved that. There yeah. are so many funny, weird I, I things in this movie. I don't know what happened with Ruby Gilman, because that feels like they just had to put it out. Yeah, yeah, they just had to put it out somewhere. They're like, we can't put this out. It makes this one, that one seem uh, worse. Yeah. Like, way worse. That's what I'm like, saying. I want to go revisit that and drop my score down, <laughs> yeah. because, because it's bad. This <laughs> is a DreamWorks movie. Yeah. yeah. This is how you do it. Yeah, yeah. I want to give it like a, I want to give it like a 7-4. I enjoyed the shit out of it. Yeah, I can't tell. I, I don't think I'm quite at an 8. Because no, no, no. it is still like a kid's movie. No, the first one you know is probably I mean? an eight. The first one is criminally underrated. And, and it's not stronger than the first it's, one. It's not. But, but it's on par. No, it's back up to yeah. like, I'll take another one. After two, I was like, I don't really I'll need do, it anymore. I'll do seven, five. Yeah. Okay. I yeah. hope we get some more specials. I, def- I want at least another holiday more special. More Christmas specials. Because those are great, too. The holiday specials are amazing. And they use the big budget for the holiday specials, so they're not garbage. And doing a four would be weird because it's like... Just keep it at the trilogy. Yeah, you don't need any more. You don't need to I do I would a take four. another one just well, because of how good it is. They're doing Kung Fu Panda 4, so like, they're, it's not, they're not against it, I guess. That's true, but... We popped that cherry, I guess, for doing 4s. You know, Shrek 4, fucking Kung Fu Panda 4. I think allegedly 4 is supposed four. to be, like, way different, though. Like, it's, like, him on his own, and he's a... Oh, oh really? You know, I don't Kung, think everybody's Kung coming Fu Panda? back. Oh, but, like, on purpose. Like, oh, I think it's supposed to be, you know, Okay. Some. Yeah. Let's jump into some uh, spoilers there. So, there so, you go. Um, if you haven't seen the movie... Which you haven't. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, if you want to hear, like we're about, to, we'll get into it. So the the wedding, which I thought was hysterical, because it, it they set up this whole thing after the intro of, with the boy band uh, stuff, which they have like they all quit because they can't pull off a move. That's basically something. <laughs> that. 
They all get into a fight. That's how real showbiz works, by the way. The smallest thing can cause everybody on the show or the band or the whatever to go, yeah. you know what? We're not perfect. It's like, no, man, let's just fucking have fun, dude. <laughs> yeah, I'm John Dory. <laughs> Do it again. Yeah, he's <laughs> super Dory over here. <laughs> Don't look at me. <laughs> so so we get to this whole, every, after that, it's all setting up for the wedding. We get, we get a... A song back into Bergen Town, which I loved because we that's, didn't get a Bergen Town. That's for what like I'm saying. I seven didn't, years. I didn't need the beginning shit because like that beginning where they're like on the song floating on the shit mm-hmm. and like everything. Like first everything movie. is NFL awesome. Movie. Everything is awesome. Like a movie, you know. And it's just like I wish the movie started out like that because that's like the vibe you need and to it's get cool through straight off the bat. Exactly. Yeah. And you get to see how Bergen Town went from the first movie when they introduced you in and it's just like a hell hole and everybody. Yeah. Sucks what are they singing? Now there's they're like singing flowers. the uh, gorilla song. Remember? Right. Yeah. Uh, happy, I'm feeling. <laughs> And everybody wants to kill themselves, but now it's like yeah. all the trees are blooming. Everybody's singing in the streets. They're walking yeah. their animals because they don't need trolls to be happy. Yeah, yeah it's fine. So, and you're like, nice. cool. Yeah, and they're like coexisting. But then yeah. the wedding in- instantly interrupted and put to the side to the point where Gristle's like, "Can we? Can we? We're going to lose the venue. We're gonna lose the deposit. I've got caterers waiting. Guys, we're the ones getting married. It's so funny. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah. One second. One second. Anyway, <laughs> just a little like stuff. the like the like cut-ins that he did it was into there like. They're trying to get the movie going, and he's like, I got real issues here, guys. I don't give a fuck about you, you guys trying it. to start a third movie. I wanted him to say something like, I see why we ate them. Because yeah. they were being so irritating. <laughs> like, we're just trying to get married, guys. Like, can you do your business once we're done being yeah, married? Yeah, we, we just need 10 seconds. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> no, the, the jokes in this movie were really funny. The bachelor party bit. McLovin just dropping the one-liners like... The Chris, second they say, I, I Mince, do, right? Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Like she jumps on top of him and, like, starts <laughs> ripping his clothes off and they're, like, rolling around. It's <laughs> when she, like, walks down the aisle and, like, the roller skates. <laughs> so stupid. Man. And he's, like, so hot. <laughs> it just, yeah, it felt like this. Sh- that's why it just invokes the first movie so much. Yeah. You feel like you skip the world tour. Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying because we're right back to the Bergens, we're right back to Zoe Deschanel and, and Christopher Mintz, and it's like it, it's like we never left never the second movie be. or the the first movie. Yep. Yeah, this and is, it's like to me, World Tour is like if you just want some bonus troll stuff, you can go watch that, but nothing really of consequence happens. Yeah, because it's fun to they don't look get married, at. they don't nothing really other furthers their relationship. They re kind of prove that no, they, they still need. just like hug at the end of that one, right? Like, which is weird because at the beginning, like. He wants to clearly marry her, and she's like, "That'd be weird, right?" If we got married, it's like, "Well, didn't you say your boyfriend and girlfriend?" So why would that be weird? Why would that be weird? Because I, well, I guess it's only been six weeks in real time, <laughs> but to us, it's been eight, nine years as viewers because we're like, "What do you mean?" Like, be that's weird? a sustainable relationship and very healthy, actually. <laughs> <laughs> but like in universe, it's like, uh, fucking no, month and a half. <laughs> yeah. But then again, she's also <laughs> best friends with Bridget. When trolls age, like, whatever, I don't know, quicker, so because Jeffrey Tambor's character goes from first to second one, and he's, like, crusty. He's disheveled. <laughs> and then two to three, he's the Super same. disheveled. Yeah, he looks the same. He looked the exact Nobody, like, same. Nobody, sounds. He's just, this, I know, because they replaced the voice actor. the actor. But still, that guy, he just sounds, in comparison, he's just, like, disheveled. Yeah. And they only use him to explain, to try to explain away a retcon po- plot hole, and it doesn't work. No, that bit sucked. That if bit that's was what they terrible. were gonna do. Yeah. Then what they should have said, and we'll okay, so we'll jump a little ahead here because they go on an adventure. It basically they reset up the first movie. They need to we gotta go on one an of the, adventure. One and of save. the Brozone brothers has been kidnapped by it's two by two pop stars who are using the essence of a troll to sound like the first movie to perform better. <laughs> but instead of happiness, it's it's talent. music, it's musical talent. talent. So it's the same movie. Yeah. So so and it's we gotta get all the brothers together to do the perfect family harmony, mm-hmm. which is the only thing that shatters diamonds. Because love, they say it nineteen there's, times there's a running gag that to the point keeps where going, call the authorities. <laughs> <laughs> and the response is always, but there's an it's unbreakable diamond prison. And it's always like, Oh. And always confusion, like, but but yeah, but call the authorities. Like constantly. And there's also like, how many siblings? Do I get a sibling when he drops that line? Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like he, yeah, like they're self-aware of like how ridiculous and sisters the plot coming is. out the woodwork. Yeah, yeah, this movie's ridiculous. The movie is basically that we're gonna go from location to location, and the brothers like, I'm settled down. I don't want to leave. And then, oh, but oh, Floyd's but for the, been kidnapped. But for the favorite brother, we'll go. We'll go, not for you, but for our bro. 
Not you. Clearly not you, John Dory. Yeah, you suck. <laughs> Eric Andre was great, too. And them all performing, Anna Kendrick jumping on the NSYNC mm-hmm. songs was like, okay, that's cool. That's yeah, fun to listen to. It was just an upbeat, yeah. fun, happy, colorful. And like the weird like Muppet people who like one weird. of the brothers is married to. Like, what the so fuck was weird. going on there? Yeah. I'm like, I, I'm like, are all these different toys in like Hasbro's? Like, like is weird this universe? even? These are supposed to be the troll like dolls, right? Like, yes, I don't know. Isn't that what it's supposed I to be? Guess, is it supposed to be the troll dolls with like the hair? Right? I guess they do have the weird ones because in the second one they had that friend that just showed up. That's always reminds me of the South Park bit where they just had the random person come in and do the lines. And they're like, "Who are you, kid?" <laughs> with the girl troll that's like, "Yeah, we got to go on an adventure." And I'm like, "Who is this girl troll?" <laughs> And where did she come from? I think I know who you're talking about. Yeah, they just start one. adding ones. And yeah, and she's gone again. Gone. Yeah, every James Corden. No James Corden. I'm not going to complain. I'm not going to complain about that. Complain I'm about so that. happy we got Keenan along for the adventure with Anna Kendrick and Justin Timberlake instead of like tall neck guy we didn't and need like James Corden big and blue all the other. bubbly. No, fuck no, them. No. I hate them. I hate those trolls. They suck. This was the core. This is the this core. Was... Yeah, they really, really narrowed it down in this one. So yeah. she gets a sister. Which is, they punch you, by the way, with foreshadowing 11 <laughs> times in the first eight minutes of the movie. I wish yeah. I had a sister. Like you know, I if I had a sister. A missing sister or anything. <laughs> I <laughs> wish that, I had a sister. That'd be weird. You're so lucky. And that cut to King, the King Poppy, who, 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 or Peppy, who's just like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that would be crazy. That'd be weird. Yeah. Weird. So just, and then, of course, they do the whole, the sister's crazy thing, which like, I didn't like the explanation. If it would have been. So we did have an. I did have another daughter, and I thought she died in the thing because that's what they say. But Not I was so depressed, it. nobody wanted to talk about it. Right. So we didn't talk about it. Right. That would have still been more believable. Not just like I just didn't want to tell Poppy. Not, they literally no troll left behind <laughs> eleven times in the first movie, and then he tries to explain in this one like I did yell no troll left behind a bunch of times, but that was only because I thought there was no troll left behind. Like no 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 no. You come out of the cave. No troll left behind. No one. You do this. No troll left and behind. Poppy's up there. Yeah. No troll left behind. And they go, Princess Poppy. Uh, the whole crowd goes, whole crowd's there. Whole crowd's there. They whole didn't go, there. What about the older princess that's actually the heir to the throne? Yeah, what about the feature queen? Where's the Where's the feature queen? <laughs> Did we forget about her? Did we forget about her? What's going on there? Sorry, that retcon doesn't work for me. We stayed in the Bergen tree and we fought off until we could, until our last troll, some of us die. We don't need this. No. I didn't need any of this, by the way. I'm cool with Branch having his brothers. That may, that's fine. And I I'm can cool make with them going sense. to some female troll there, but I didn't need it. Are you, you know, uh, King Pepe? Is King Pepe your dad? It could have been that way, but what if King Pepe had a, 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 a wife before? It's like a Jon Snow situation. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, my mom <laughs> like a, died. Like a Game and, of Thrones, like a Gendry kind right. of deal. Yeah. That's still more believable. I mean, you had to mention people died, so how adult is it be? Is it really to just be like, oh, we had another family, and my mom died, and we thought he died too. Oh, my God, he had your... King oh my god because she That's goes so i can't believe you're alive yeah. it's like they almost wrote that and it's like they almost stuck the landing like, no. no we just went the other side out of the tree the we got to do a cutaway gag to uh king peppy in the bar talking to Meow. yeah <laughs> a little we had to get guy. the one line in there for the and it's like they're cutting to him while the other daughter is expositing to Poppy, and it's like that, so that scene did not that's, work. That's for us, none of though. that worked. And I know, it was terrible. but it was terrible because well, it's that's like the worst part of the movie. None guys. of this works. I didn't want it anyway. You didn't need to over explain no. it. That's the only that's problem. The yep. And they showed her in the fucking trailer, and she's all over that's the twist. fucking posters, dude. Because it's Kamiya. It's, ca- it's, like, it's Kamiya um, Cabello, who I love. Okay, who I would marry. Well, okay, yeah. Um, Their hair is like braided together in like a. Like a you know those dual Twizzler flavors. Yes, it kind of looks like that. Uh, right on the poster, yeah. and I'm like, of course she's the sister. What do you mean? Of course she's the sister. I'm her being the sister, but the route they took to get there, it, was, it felt so it almost cheap. Almost ruins the first it felt so movie. Cheap. There was no need for that. No. Oh yeah, you had an older sister that got out the back of the tree, but we're not going to mention it at all in the first movie. That would literally have built her entire. It would have changed her whole personality. She's an only child. She has the personality of an only child. She center was, of attention. She was yeah. old enough to rem- or, uh, to do things with the kid that little kids will remember, but for some reason she doesn't remember but until that. her memories jog, <laughs> and then she remembers doing them with her sister. And yeah. you're like, <laughs> until she on, shows guys. her the scrapbook. Yeah. yeah. That's, that was the worst part of the movie, and, and that sucks because there was, again, no reason for it. They could have taken, just don't explain it. It's just a long-lost sister. Just that don't explain it. Dad. Again, you fine, can with assume it being, yourself. fine with it being a sister. Exactly. I didn't need the different part of the tree and, and dad didn't know you can no, infer that dad that. 
it had a different wife. That dad no, got busy that. on the side. You don't have to say anything. You can infer a million things and just have the sister show up and it's long lost sister and then that Pepe's happy if they show that at the end. That's all. Yeah, we're not even there. We're not even here for the sister. We need the fucking, we need branches, brother. We don't even need you for the fucking plot yeah. and you don't come along anyway. So why did we do that for 10 minutes? And again, why? we are nitpicking because it's a kid's movie. Why? But it was just like, I, that. it was such an over. It felt like we just thing. need to add characters. Well, Branch has brothers in this one, so Poppy needs a sister. Again, which is fine, but the way they did it. But the way they did like, it. It's so weird it's and overthought. so cheap. So yeah. overthought. Yeah. Just give her a sister. Well, where's she from? Long lost sister. Yeah, but how? We don't need to explain I don't it because, fucking care. because it's the B-plot. Right. So we don't necessarily have to go <laughs> deep into it. We can leave that for the next movie or special and actually flesh that out so we don't look like jackasses just giving you some ham-fisted hey, excuse. You know, here's a better plot. What if they don't even run into the fucking sister and the Bergens stumble upon her and then, like, because they want to kill her but because Bridget's learned so much about trolls, she convinces them that they're good and then they team up to go save yeah, Poppy and then Poppy the learns at the very end she has that she has a sister. Way better. But they had to deliver the MacGuffin scrapbook to the sister who can then show Bridget. That's what I'm saying, so but we didn't need that because Bridget's so educated on like liking the trolls now she could have been like nah man we dig you we're not gonna She's eat like, you you look like poppy my or, like, my best friend like right uh, who her dad oh my god my give me that any conversation other way, any instead other of right. mixing the a plot with the sister b plot For and no it's reason. like no we don't need yeah. that we don't need any of that yeah and the brothers picking up the brothers i like that plot better it's fun and the sister thing distracted from that and i'm like no 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 you wife, guys are on a way, roll. Oh, you're on a roll. It was man. amazing. The like, puppet? Yeah, that was like in love with the, yeah. <laughs> the troll. Like, the weird, oh, yeah. The weird Muppet lady? She's like yeah. constantly like in love with him. Like he was in a band. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, and yeah. the kids are like looking at her like, what the hell? The pink it? eye? Yeah. It was so Leave good. before you get pink eye. That's yeah. how we gave it such a high score. There's, I mean, yeah, there was plenty of good bits, but that was definitely. Good. That's the weakest part of That's the, the weakest part the is the sister is thing. Fine. I like yeah. the in performance. I like how they had to do a dance off because it makes sense. It's a Trolls movie. You know, it makes more sense than Guardians. Yeah, can we talk about the bad guys for a little bit? Velvet and Veneer, who are dubbed as teenagers on the wiki from Mount Rageous. Um, which, which is, is basically the, which is the land of like humanish people that all just live on this mountain island in that you sky. have to like get to through like a weird ship. I don't know through hustle, through hustle mode. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what is happening. Which again, I'm fine with all that, and I appreciate that they didn't break down 20 minutes to explain the city. It. I don't need it. I didn't need it. Cool. I don't need it. It's just some it's weird. It's just weird. It's kind of like uh like uh what, the Jimmy Neutron movie when all the parents are gone and everybody's just partying and you know crazy. It's like how? Don't worry about it. Yeah, I don't care. It doesn't matter. Anyway, <laughs> so Velvet and Veneer are bad guys, and they're dubbed as teenagers, and they basically need the essence of talented trolls yep. because they're nobodies. It's like when uh, uh, when TikTokers who lip sync <laughs> try and get on stage to do an actual musical performance, and then they get booed off of the stage. Yeah. And it's happened it. multiple times to people who That's now true. have TV shows. Mm-hmm. Yeah, which is weird. But I'm not an Amy Schumer fan. No. I, I will go on record. Vel- I think Velvet. she's a joke-stealing, not funny person. Who's Veneer? He's uh, he's another he's a voice a guy that's been in a bunch of stuff. Oh, okay, he's not All right. A, yeah, he. But um, Amy Schumer is the lead she, villain. She delivers lines for the bad guy of the movie, like <laughs> you know I have no talent, you know I'm a talentless hack, you know. And I'm yeah, just, because I'm the characters, going, oh my God, the characters have no talent, and they need the talented essence of the trolls to even so perform. So when this drops on Blu-ray, it shows them fucking singing, and they're and like. She's like <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I just think it's oh so funny God. that she wasn't self-aware oh my God. enough to not do that. Because when that drops digitally, you know everyone in the world is taking those audio clips. I know. It's like it's over now. Like, why would you even? Like, I need yeah. you to read that line again. Just in the middle of one again. of her stand-up bits. It's just like, I'm a talentless hack. <laughs> she had one good line, and it was when she's talking to her the brother. She's like, when, when I met you, you were just sucking your thumb and pooping everywhere. <laughs> Cause I was a baby. Cause I was a baby. Yeah, yeah. She's uh, like, don't remind me. <laughs> like, okay, that line was funny. That one got me. Yeah, for sure. But you know, that was just she didn't write uh, that. No, yeah. <laughs> no. But everything worked. It was. It worked. Yeah, the bad guys were. I I did like the bad guy of Trolls Two probably better than this. But like, it's pretty much the same. It's the same ending. These people want to take over the off, world with using performance, troll power, using troll power. 
Yeah, and we're going to go around and take the essence of different trolls. Instead of them doing the work, we're just going to bait them here. I'm like, oh, they're smarter than the trolls Bergens. too bad guy. Or, or them. Or the Bergens. Yeah, they're yeah. smarter than both. Yeah, they're just going to invite them to perform musically. Why didn't the Bergens do that? <laughs> One night only. Trolls. Yeah, we, won't eat, we won't eat you if you perform musically. Okay. Okay, la la la. No, 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 no. Yeah, your stage they is this. They let sing and then eat them. Your stage is this frying pan yeah. on an open flame, weirdly. But yeah, just come Hop on in. in. Just perform. Bro zone. Right on. Yeah. So yeah, it all ends happy ever after, like you can imagine it does. All loose ends tied. Everybody's great. Bro zone's back good. together. They're all for some reason. Oh, they're performing at Spruce's place. Bruce, or, please. Bruce. Well, now he's Spruce again because now he's back to performing. My favorite thing was every time they all like come in, like John Dory's like fat now, like Spruce is like surfing. He's like he's this like super fat, fat super yeah. fat troll with the Branch giant the, hair. Branch and the Branch is the only normal and one. The other one, the Clay. weird one. Yeah. yeah, but even he looks a little funky. You know yeah, he's what I mean? Skinny, but like yeah, cracked out, skinny. whacked out. <laughs> So yeah, I say seven four, yeah. seven five over here. It's it's definitely fun when this comes out. I would definitely take the kids. It's good for as the parents. You guys will you got it's it's got a good good adult jokes. Yeah, the yeah. honeymoon jokes just over and the over. The honeymoon and over. jokes. Keenan gets a bunch of one liners that are super funny. The hustle mode is and the movie is, is self aware. Great. Yeah, like, it's like we know someone after someone that got to touch it up after it was written is like there's too much sibling crap in here and keenan keeps talking about how much it's self-referential it's too much and yeah. it's funny yeah 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 when yeah. that little fluffy assistant is like now whose sister is this and i'm like oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> so was she great. um I don't know what she was. was she kitty like, from uh arrested development maybe um the I, assistant i would say she almost sounded like um jenny a, slate okay it might have been but jenny i wasn't slate. sure it might be jenny slate up, yeah because that's like the other voice like Ki- kitty too yeah yeah, yeah. Actually, like a mix of that. those mm. two voices yeah hmm. because she was like also working and she's like smashes it's like worst assistant fucking ever this movie was great yeah definitely go see it hopefully you've tuned out at this point if you um didn't care about or um you know cared yeah. about the movie yeah. at all if you didn't care and you just like us riffing on fucking movies, if you had then no plans to see it and you watch this whole thing, I'm telling you, it's worth it. It's, go see it's it. It's really funny. Or catch it when it drops on streaming. Yeah, because it'll be on Peacock. Seventeen fucking. day exclusive, then it'll be on streaming. That's it. Three Mike week, drop. three weekends in the theater. That's fucking perfect. Peacock knows how to do it, man. Yeah. Yep. Is that Peacock? Right. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. So by Christmas, this will be you'll be able to watch it at home. So fucking a. Yeah. Perfect. All right, Trolls Three, first uh fifteenth uh, uh, ever movie re- early movie review from us. Uh, yeah, we'll, we're saying 15th because we already saw 15 other We'll be back we uh, next week for Wonka, I think. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Um, you never know. Hunger Games review coming tomorrow. <laughs> Mike, drop. They somehow <laughs> merged their DNA and made like an offspring baby, but I like yours better. The Rock cosplaying, or the Vin Diesel cosplaying as The Rock. I would buy that. <laughs> Go check that. He's got it it's, up here. It's Rin. <laughs> but but go look at go look it up. It's just, it's it's ridiculous. It'd be like it would be like making you Native American. I'm not even trying to yeah, be disrespectful. Yeah, that's not okay. He'd be like, that's not good. No, not okay. change it to what I Please look like. Please no. Yeah, it's totally missing the mark. <laughs>